But yeah, Randy Orton uh, gave his stamp of approval to Austin Theory by saying that he views him as a future world champion one day. Sarah, I know I, I can kind of guess what you uh, say to this, but how about you just tell us what you think? Okay, I have the quote first. Nice. That's... um. Yeah. So Randy said, I don't have a crystal ball or anything, but Austin Theory is young and he's got a great look. I know that I know where his head's at. I've had plenty of talks with him and a lot of the things I did as a kid that I maybe shouldn't have the distractions that I was confronted with. He doesn't have those. I think he's just a little more gung ho motivated and he sees the goal. He sees the prize. He know what he knows what he wants. And I think he'll definitely be a world champion one day. Um, So I. I like that people think this in him. And I think, uh, you know, I've said that I think that he needs a character change because I think uh, he, it's just not working right now. I, I I think that part of the problem is s- some of these types of heel characters where there's not a whole lot of depth to the character other than like, I'm better than you. I think I'm hot. Like, look at my abs. Like, I'm just cooler than you. Like, mm. that's not something that people really gravitate towards or really hate anymore and it's like a certain type of person can really do that to get you to hate them and i just don't think that austin really has that and it might just be because they're not really putting him in a situation to thrive with that character could also just be maybe he's too nice of a person in real life that it's just difficult for him to sell that (laughs) you know i know that for the most part outside of like his run with the way in NXT, I think that he's mostly been a heel throughout his career, even before he got to WWE. So it's just like, okay, you just think that that's what's going to happen. Mm-hmm. Um, but I think if they can put him on a better track, then yeah, he could be a world champion. He probably should be a world champion. I feel like he could be a he great be. baby face champion. He'd at be least a really good baby well, face champion. Yeah. I feel like the way, and I'm not saying that he is, but the way that people think that Cody Rhodes can be like a great babyface champion, it feels like to me, it's like, I think that Austin Theory could be in that situation. Not the same level as Cody Rhodes, I'm not saying that, but I do think that he could be like, if he's the face of Raw, like I could see, or something, you know what I mean? Like if he got moved to Raw, I could see that. Mm. Um, I could see I think that, that it, too. it. I think it means, it says a lot though, when a guy like Randy Orton is saying this kind of stuff about him. Oh, that means so, a lot. That when you yeah. have a veteran like Orton in your corner, that you, they view you as a world champion one day. That's not obviously the end all be all, but it definitely helps when somebody's in your ear trying to make that decision in creative. And not only that, this little few mini feud, I would say, with his tag team champion partner uh, Grace Waller, after we saw in SmackDown, it's mm-hmm. planting the seeds for him to be a baby face. It really is. Like it's just. He's so and Theory's just so innocent. You know what I mean? Like That's he's just such a nice he's... innocent. Yes, yes. But he like doesn't he want you to think that. You know what I no. mean? And it's he like he does play about. like an arrogant character really well. Like just the, the things that the the mannerisms and the stuff that he does. Like yeah, he can come off like that. But I just think that he's not in a position to thrive as that character because i think that it it kind of is like one of the stereotypical easy heel characters that anyone does because it's like the easiest thing to do but i don't feel like they're as popular as they once were nor do they really garner as much hate as they used to um and so i feel like it's just not working for him so i'm like okay then you got to utilize him in a different way and see what else he can do and i feel like he could be really likable um very likable like, why were they sending him to children's hospitals you know what i'm saying like he was doing that shit and it's like yeah because he's really nice but he shouldn't be doing that because he's supposed to be hated but you were still sending him with like bianca belair like what are we doing mm-hmm. like why aren't you then taking advantage of him being this nice guy on screen like actually do that 